three dimensions. Right. Right. It takes a piece of plastic and it tests it into the shape. And you have plastic that she does that. All right. What? That's something. Yeah. Something that she wants to do. production studio. Over here in the corner, I cannot tell you what it's called because I forget. Does everyone know what a 3D printer is? Yes! Great. That's a 3D printer that prints it out of metal as opposed to plastic. That's why it has the yellow curtain and the big thing because as it cuts the metal, tiny pieces get sucked up inside of there because it's very dangerous. Um, so that's why that all looks like that. Over here, you're gonna see all kinds of scenery that has already been completed. We're, uh, you're gonna see several shows as we walk through here. We have three different operas from, uh, excuse me, the Sarasota Opera that are being built right now. Um, Susanna, uh, the one I can't pronounce, so I'm not gonna remember. It begins with an N, you'll see it written over there. And the, one I, the other one I can't remember because I don't remember. Um, so you'll see all of that. Over here, you're going to see these curved walls right here as you pass them. These are, we're doing a production of a show called A Doll's House Part 2. Um, and all of these curved walls that you're going to see around the room um, have been built for that and they are done. And they will move on to paint next to get all of their paint artwork. You will see, uh, we'll walk over to the paint studio next. All, this, um, all of these dark brown pieces of wood are from our production of The Crucible, which will start in uh, January at the theater. Because when we work and build a show, we try to work as far in advance as possible. The scenery for Crucible, which has not even begun rehearsals yet, is complete. It's done. A Doll's House Part Two is the next show. They're just about done. We have, uh, we have a show of Around the World in 80 Days, which starts in June and they have just begun building its scenery. So we try to work as far ahead as possible. For our production of The Music Man, uh, that scenery was built and completed June of last year, and we're about to open it this week. So they really want to work with designers as far as they can in advance to get caught up, which is why we have the space right now to build three operas for other people. The opera has contracted us to build those, we build it for them, they come take it away. Now what we do in here too is when we build scenery, we'll put the whole thing together so that we know it works. We take it apart, we put it onto a tractor trailer truck and we bring it over to the theater or the opera takes it to their opera house or we also have built several shows of late for Norwegian Cruise Lines. So they come down from Tampa, they load up the show that we've built for them, and away it goes for them. So you'll see all of that. So look around, please. Again, I'm just going to keep saying it. Please don't touch anything because I don't want anything to fall on you or you break anything. Um, we're going to go around the corner next into the paint area. So the area on the other side of this wall is all paint. They will lay down entire floors and set pieces, and you'll see some of the opera pieces. 